assalamu alaikum guys i hope you're fine and doing well in the last tutorial we have uh, done info window how can we create an info window on a marker on a click of a marker now in this tutorial i will show you how can we draw a line between two markers for example if you have one marker here one marker here and you want to show the relationship between two markers or for example you want to draw a line between the two markers which we call a polyline between two marker three or four how many uh, late long you have in a list okay and that list you pass into the function which i have created here it will create the lines between all those markers but for now we will uh, see for example two markers this is the function <clears throat> okay i have uh, initialized the polyline okay which is the built-in function of uh, google map the way we did uh, info window for info window okay like this google dot maps dot info window same google dot maps dot polyline <clears throat> here path we have to pass late longs a list of late longs an array of late longs okay in this format <clears throat> this one okay we will use the same uh, which i have commented and then we have uh, uh, geo okay this is also a function okay then we use a stroke color right what will be its color then opacity stroke opacity means that how if you want it to be very dark or transparent so if you decrease it it will be less dark and stroke weight how uh, big you want your uh, line to be okay <clears throat> like uh, what will be the width of your uh, line which you are drawing and this will be the color okay uh, so we have created this line and then we have we are going to set this line to the map okay but the so the first thing is we have created a function okay and to that function we are passing a parameter late longs so what we are going to do we will uncomment uh, to late long first then we have pushed into this array okay created a uh, late long pushed into this array another pushed into this array so we have two late long two locations inside this array okay so first we will what we will do we will create marker multiple marker the way we did in the previous tutorial how to um, create multiple marker on a map so through this for loop we will create multiple markers okay once we create it multiple markers for example we have only two markers so it will create two markers then i need a relationship between these two markers a line between these two markers so what i will do is i have both the uh, late long inside this array so i will just pass this array to this function okay this is the function i need this array to pass to this function once i pass this okay so here it will do its uh, thing and it will draw a line for us okay on the map so let's check if it works fine or not so it's a few step away thing first we created a function for for a line then we have to pass an array of late long if it, there are two or three array uh, late long it will be record uh, between those line those markers if there are two or three markers for example so though the lines will be between those um, markers f2 then the line will be between those two markers it depends on how much uh, locations or how much markers you have created how much late long you have passed and this uh, array so let's check it okay guys let's check it
uh, it should have created two markers okay don't know where yes it's here but I don't know why the markers are not created it had uh, drawn the line okay between two locations but the thing is why the marker is not created because why as we have mm -hmm. yes we have to comment this line of code because it's making it null every time so again we will refresh it uh, when uh, inside this place marker function I have this piece of code we check if the marker is there it make it null so we have we did it for a click of uh, click on the map to create a new marker and remove the old one so we don't need for now okay now we will check yes see so these two are the markers okay and this is the line if you want your line to be more with more weight or uh, you know so you can increase it you can give it another color green okay if you pass three late long so it will be between the three let's pass three so now one two three inside this array okay the, that array is passed to this function and it will do the rest for us the color is green okay now let's check again see the color is green and now it is between the three markers the lines yeah, yeah, yeah. so this is the way how can we draw a polyline on the map I hope you have got and uh, if you have any question you can ask in the comments or you can send me email please don't forget to subscribe my channel for more videos and if you need this uh, source code you can ask me I will send you thank you